to change filament and do a multicolored print using the Cura software um, and a printer bot play. So Cura has this great thing built into it, I'll show you here in the plugins called Tweak at Z and Change Filament. That's something I put in. Pause at Height. I tried everything, I'm rewriting the G code, and nothing seems to work until uh, I discovered this G code. So we're going to ha you have to do this. You have to print with USB. So when you open up your printer face, you are going to let it connect, and I'm ready to print already at 210 here. So I'm going to home it to the X and the Y. And then the Z. And now I'm just going to press print. Usually what I do when I know I want to pause as, at a certain height, I have to keep an eye on the printer. So. I don't like to be rushing, so I'll type in the G code right away without pressing enter, so I know when I'm going to stop it, I just have to press that enter. So I'm going to type in the G code. Now the G code for pause is G4. G4 will pause it, but with the printer bot play specifically, and in, in most printer bots, they don't have the resume button on. So you want to pause it for a certain amount. In my case, I like to pause it for 15 seconds. So when I do that, I type in S, make sure these are capital, and then 0, 1, 5. That stands for seconds, 15. So now when I press the enter key, when I'm ready to pause, I can just, I can just press the enter key, and it'll pause it for 15 seconds, which will give me enough time to uh, replace the filament. Okay, so I'm ready to press enter. I'm going to stop my print. I'm going to pull out my filament here and replace it with the yellow filament. And let it continue. At this point, uh, we are now good. Eventually, all that silver is going to come make its way through, and we're going to get a nice uh, print at the end, hopefully.